Hey guys, Fadi just let you know that the guy uh, on YouTube have uploaded a new video basically showing off uh, how he have rooted his uh, Kindle Fire and then he have basically installed a custom ROM of Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich on that device. Now I, I know I said sandwich, not sandwich, uh, but really they should change the name to sandwich because that uh, feels easier and you know it's easier to say in your mouth. But what's so cool about this is that you know this is a tablet that is selling in millions right now just because it comes with this attractive pricing like 250 bucks and it's taking up uh, you know some of this market that you know if this tab wouldn't be you know released right now you know Apple, Apple would sell you know millions of more tablets but now when this you know budget tablet is coming in here uh, with Android uh, you could you know you know it, it's good it's awesome 250 bucks uh, you know you, you can buy two of these or you can buy an iPad 16 gigabyte. What would you buy? Uh, probably this device if you have, you know, want to want to play around uh, and stuff like that. And th that's the cool thing about Android is you can go ahead and install these, you know, custom ROMs if you root it and stuff like that. Um, and basically, the Kindle Fire comes with like a modified version of Android 2.3 or something like that. Uh, that is kind of limited. Uh, but now with this kind of you know video, as uh, I'm gonna leave in the description. He have basically, as I said there, it's, it's some kind of like alpha version that you made or something like that, or uh, Android Fubin the ice cream sandwich. Uh, and, uh, you know, the Wi-Fi doesn't work, uh, the sound doesn't really work right now. Uh, but still, I mean, it probably will work in the future. And, you know, if you compare to point Android, like that limited version of Android that you got before in the Kindle Fire, uh, versus this fully, you know, you can do like whatever you want with this Android 4.0. Uh, it's it's insane, and I think tons of you know people are gonna buy the Kindle Fire just you know so they can hack with it and you know try new things out, and uh, it, it's good. It doesn't cost that much. It doesn't cost 500 bucks. It's been sold in millions already. It's a new tablet, and you know if you haven't checked it out. Uh, be definitely sure to go ahead and do so because uh, this tablet got some potential, especially now when you know people are porting over Android 4.0 to it, and uh, yeah, so that's great. See. You.